course. It's Michael. You're the peacemaker. So, isn't this nice? Let's hope so. Yeah, let's hope so. If we can just get five minutes without you two arguing, I'll be happy. It's not gonna happen. Nice work, Slick. We're gonna be doing pat-downs at the airport before those fucking clowns are done with us. You know, fuck you. Hey, hey, look, man. It is what it is. Now, how the fuck we gonna get this done? I don't know. Hey, how's therapy going, Mikey? Had any breakthroughs? Firstly, fuck you. And secondly, clearly not. I'm still spending time with you. See, Frank, Trevor is the one who really needs therapy. Or medicating, or being neutered, or something like that. You know, he's taking his childhood issues out on the rest of humanity, and until the rest of us suffer as much as him, he ain't gonna stop. Man, do either of you ever stop? You know the airfield's mine, don't you? Oh, yeah, you can afford a runway, but you can't afford to move out of that corrugated metal death shack. So how you guys doing? Well, we're alive. Hey, good work down there. I'm the one who says thank you. He was helping me. Thank you, Franklin. Yeah, it's cool, homie. And thank you, Chop. Hey. Hey, so Frank. Hey, no, 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 me first. Franklin, whatever you do, hey. Don't listen to advice from Michael. <laughs> hey, he came to me for advice. Our whole relationship is based on him wanting my advice. Man, that was before I got to know you. Now, I don't listen to anything either of you say. How you doing, Frank? And how are you doing, Mr. Plastic? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, you are so real. See, Frank, this right here is reality. Fucking cut, yeah. Wonderful. Yeah, my oh, tax fuck? dollars are done. Finish this shit. Oh, oh, damn! damn. Ah. Some clapped out hipster psychopath with mommy issues. That's reality. I am not a hipster. Please shut up. Fault of you. I'm begging you, alright? It's 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 not inappropriate. It's, it's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. First you take a hostage against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her. Are you nuts? She's she's a 60-year-old housewife. Wow, she's 57. And she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them, and now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey. Mother. Hey, why? No. You got me out here. You broke me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. What's going on, ladies? Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael. Business. All right? I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time-consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Uh -huh. You know, you know, frankly, if there's one thing that you're going to learn from being around us... Please, just... fucking insanity. Then they can't fry it. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck is useless. Ah. Ho, ho, hold on, man. Can y'all knock this shit off? So, Frank, if you've learned anything, it's this. Be real, like me. Hey, man, you're like a heightened version of something, but I don't know if it's reality. Oh, it is, bro. I'm hyper real. Oh, hyper's right. And look, Trevor's a lot of fun, but I got a family. I got interest in life outside of killing people. I'm the real one. I'm the guy you should be emulating. Oh, eh. you're not real. You're a hall of mirrors. Dead or alive, friend or enemy, husband or John. No, no, no. Hey, both of you. Damn, I didn't hook up with you for reality. I got enough reality as it is, man. I hooked up with you to hear you bickering like school kids, evidently. Shit. Yeah, yeah. Why'd you invite this stoolie, huh? We want Lamar to be rescued, not sold to the feds. Give it a rest, asswipe. Man, what y'all two shut the fuck up? Now let's take a look at this place, man. Lester said this was some type of big weed store spot. This is crawling with ballers, you know? Now me and you, we don't mind the old 
gang warfare, but sway bucks over there. <laughs> Tell Trevor I said bite me. Man, I say shut up. Now I see the weaver. Where the fuck is Lamar? Oh shit, there we go. You know, tell Trevor I'm gonna be up on this hill with my rifle. I don't want to be anywhere around him when he fucks this whole thing up. Classic, classic, huh? He's already planning his escape. Oh, fuck. Fucking glory seat. Oh, you got any better ideas? Obviously not, otherwise you already killed me and done the gig yourself. I mean, what kind of vain asshole decides that the best way to rob the largest holding bank on the West Coast is for him, and him personally, to come at the front door? The kind of vain asshole who's stuck working with you, dude. Okay, all right, all right, ladies. We gotta move. Come on. Man, can we fucking do this? <laughs> Hustle up! You guys, redistribute the weight. Here they are. Hey, good work, Captain. Ah. Damn, I can't believe we got the mail. Damn right, all without firing a bullet. Ah, oh, don't forget our pace here, uh, huh? The lead ain't no, gonna no, be please, wasted. No, no, please don't. No, wait. Biggest score of our lives, we ain't taking any chances. Sorry, Pally. Gee. Well, no, it ain't no, a chance. No, please, please. He's in on it. Huh? Get up. Hey, get up. You tell him something that ain't on the news already. This whole thing is your idea. Yeah, yeah, I, I understand. Not a word. Exactly. Yeah, I, I always jumped. I, I, I never saw a thing. Go! Fucking going as soft as that old flaccid boy in your pants. This divorce couldn't come soon enough. Fucking A! Yeah! Oh, yeah, man! Fuck! Work first, pick a later, man, all right? Hang on. We're, we're just leaving the goal. Yep, -er. Hundreds of millions of dollars worth of gold. Hey, T, have a little faith. <coughs> faith? In you, buddy? All right, in less in the process. Come on, we've been through it a million times. Any fool can take a score. It's getting away clean that makes the difference between those who walk free and those who do not. Whew. Man, I wouldn't know what to do with that shit. I'm guessing you wouldn't either, man. Uh, I, I'm sorry. I, I just have some trusting issues right now, Franklin. If we get away with this, if, and it's a big if, man, then I can finally Really retire. Watch it, Frank. Michael likes to retire with a very interesting exit strategy. Come on, man. I mean, we just took the biggest score in the history of scores, and you bitches just want to moan. My mama never loved me. My friends never loved me. I'm mad because I'm rich. I'm sad because I'm successful. Man, this shit is pathetic, both of you. Oh, I am so sorry. Hey. We did it, assholes. We did it. So we can take it easy, knowing that uh, it's going to be a few days before Judas here shows his true colors. Really? Now? Yeah, now, sugar. Why don't you take a moment while you're sitting on that big fat pile of cash to chill the fuck out and realize what's done is done? Whatever you say. Wait, this is a good time. It's his fucking fuck, 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 fuck you, man! Hey, 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 hey! For a couple of Midwest stick-up artists, you guys sure have become a pair of whiny West Coast douchebags! What the fuck is wrong with the West Coast? Oh, nothing. I love it here. Everyone's so numbed by the sun that if you use a three-syllable word, they think you're a professor. Yeah, fuck you. Yeah, fuck you, you high and mighty weasel! And you don't talk down them to these fucking idiots. Hey, leave Lester alone! Oh! Oh, you and Lester together? Oh, now that makes fucking sense! Oh, for fuck's sake, man! You all are assholes! Man, I gotta go calm down, homie. This shit was real illuminating. Frankly, sorry. Come on back, have a beer or something. Our showdown with a private army, and you're bringing a rifle? Yeah, I'm bringing a rifle. It's a good gun. It'll get the job done. That gun? It makes me think this is a setup. It is a setup. We're setting up Merriweather and the FIB, making them think the metal's here. A setup for me. It's a weird gun and it's making me nervous. Put it down. It's a good gun. And you asking me to put it down is making me nervous. Hey, I ain't the guy with a past history of giving up his friends. You let the Chinese take me, didn't you? You might be about to pull that again with Merriweather, for all I know. 
I was in an emotional state. I can't be blamed for my actions in Ludendorff. Oh, well, can I blame you for every day you didn't come and get me after that? I ain't putting my gun away. Hey, man, what the fuck am I doing risking my ass trying to save y'all ass if you just gonna kill each other? Hey, you're not saving me. You're saving him. Now oh, you're saving this fat fuck. Hey, y'all gotta keep y'all fucking heads right and end this shit. If not, man, I'll put bullets in both of you motherfuckers. Hey, they here? I know them when I see them, homie. They creep. All right, good. Y'all hear that? Now, if we doing this shit, man, it's either now or never. Come on, Trevor. right there, okay? I'm gonna go over there. <coughs> oh, looks like we did it. Shit, for now? Exactly, for now. So, what's next, huh? Are we just gonna wait around till someone else comes to kill us, or are we gonna wait till this fucker gets turned again? Oh, fight me. Ain't anybody getting turned again, and you know it. Hey, man, the way I see it, we only just begun to clean this shit up. We got a lot of old friends I think need to be re-educated. A lot of friends. I mean, things could get really messy. No, we just got to silence a few noisy people. So now what? Now we keep a low profile and get on with our lives. As friends. Well, do I have a choice? No, no, no. All right, then. As, uh, flawed, awful, totally uncomfortable, and poorly matched friends. Absolutely. Oh, that's perfect. Then we can get back to the kind of capitalism we practice. Shit, I don't know how much more better that is than Devin's car. Ooh, hypocrisy, Franklin. Civilization's greatest virtue. Jesus, your therapist has a lot to answer for. I know, I still hate myself. But hey, at least I know the words for it now. Yeah, but I hate you, and I know the words for it. So does that mean I don't have to go to therapy? Look, man, you two motherfuckers terrify me of that middle age. I'm good. You're right to be afraid, Franklin. Yeah. Be very afraid, Franklin. <laughs> Tell you one thing, T. I'm getting too old for this nonsense. Oh. Man, y'all ain't gonna start again, are you? can't listen to another one of y'all arguments. We don't really argue, do we? We have conversations, but it's all love at the heart of it. Definitely. All love. Hey, love? I don't care what the fight's about. Just don't do it, all right? Hey, it's it's uh, good to hang out, the three of us. Sure it is, I bet. He's a lucky kid. Should we tell him? I think it's time we told him. You want to do it? I think you should. Tell me what? What you fools talking about? We're your daddies now, Franklin. We decided. Are we the fathers you always wanted? Man, look, my shitty childhood ain't something to joke about, okay? And no, no, man, hell no, nah, y'all ain't the daddies I always wanted. Because I only wanted one. And anyway, man, I looked after you idiots just as much as you look after me. Aww. Yeah, He's so grown up, isn't he? I am proud as a peacock. Man, fuck both of y'all. 